Hey guys and welcome to Gary Reviews and judging by the trailer. So today I planned other videos for my fitness channel which I still plan to record. Uh, I'm thinking about how to do my lighting better in my living room so I can film those workout videos and so on. So I am working on that just to let you know. And I was surprised that this trailer came out. I mean I didn't expect it at all. So, as always, my plans are ruined, so to speak. But anyways, I'm very excited for this, so whatever happened, I have to cover it. So, let's check now Thor Ragnarok. This was absolutely kick-ass, like, this is a totally different style from the other movies, this is just like Guardians of the Galaxy actually, if you think about it. It's amazing guys. Let's now start to, you know, break this down as much as possible. Okay, as usual guys, I fade out the trailer, but now I can bring particular shots you know, up front. Unfortunately, my mummy reaction got claimed, so my efforts there went to... Yeah, to shit. Apologies for my language. Okay, so here, Thor's been captured, and this looks very cool, how he's been captured and all, but I hope that those chains are magical, otherwise there's not going to be any uh, justification for how he's able to be restrained by those uh, chains so I hope that there's very good explanation why they can even capture him you know his tour after all so hopefully there's explanation for that that is you know makes sense how did this happen? yeah how did this happen yeah and if she is able to do that she must be extremely powerful and magical her magic must surpass the magic of the hammer for sure because otherwise how is this possible? I mean that is Thor's hammer, one of the most powerful weapons in the galaxy so how the heck she's able to not only hold it but destroy it like it's a um, piece of sugar or something. Yeah that's really shocking and if this is her her previous form, I don't know, but this is very Guardians of the Galaxy like. Asgard looks amazing as always. It's dreamy, it's magical, it's everything, it's so beautiful. I mean, this movie looks beautiful, guys. Asgard is dead. <laughs> Just the way that she said it is mm, very interesting. Like she was previously you know there attached to the place you know attached to Asgard 
but something happened that, that really made her bitter and now she wants to destroy it she wants to destroy Asgard but she kinda has a regret in her expression and the way that she said it it's like I don't want to do that but I'm going to do that and I have to do that and I am going to do that and I am doing that <laughs> so Asgard is dead <laughs> basically and the destruction is pretty huge I don't know what's going on here, but I presume that Thor is on a different place or that is just what is left from Asgard I don't know, but that doesn't seem like Asgard at all it seems like a totally different world that's kinda like a junkyard or something and I am saying all of that, you know, just guessing, haven't read anything about the story of the movie, particularly if there's anything to be read so I just prefer that, just prefer to make my own conclusions anyways and just see how it is, you know, how actually it is in the movie okay, so we see that that net here has some kind of a power so obviously that is um, enough to subdue him but I don't know, I, like I said, I hope that there's something that is going to justify that he is being captured All of that I presume that there are like flashbacks from how things were before and what actually took place before I'm not sure what that is but it looks awesome Okay, so apparently he still has to be somehow you know, weakened in order to be captured like this Yeah, that's obviously all about the space coliseum so to speak and fighting Heimdall has become a badass even more <laughs> oh wait a second wait a second that's carol urban yeah he looks badass although i'm not a fan of that you know no hair and beard look for him uh, he looks much better with the hair but he does look very interesting as a character so yeah and loki of course what side will he take? Is he going to allow Hela to raise the premium? Who knows? But he does look good. The only thing that I would say about the costumes, although they look really awesome as a design, the texture of the costumes kind of escapes me. It looks a bit cheap to me, just a bit. And the metal doesn't look like a metal, it looks like plastic i don't know it doesn't look like it has heft to it like weight uh, substance to it. it everything looks a bit lighter and a bit, a bit cheaper for some reason to me it might look totally awesome on the movie screen don't get me wrong i'm just saying what i'm seeing from the trailer because everything looks better on the movie screen of course okay let's just stop here because i have to pay tribute to those awesome arms Ah, that's so awesome. I always appreciate when actors give their all for the role, you know, in terms of uh, achieving the best physique possible. That's not an easy task, guys. Okay, he looks just awesome. Okay, you see? This kinda resembles metal, yes, but although it looks so cool, I just just love it. It it's still, you know, kinda plasticky to me. It, it looks too light. The shield also. Everything looks a bit lighter than it should, I think. And that helmet looks like it's going to fall right off when he does something like that with his head. <laughs> that's great just the best reaction ever <laughs> like yeah my friend is here yeah we're going to play now like kids in a in the backyard or something it's so great we know each other he's a friend from work and he's so genuine too like we know each other 
It's a friend from work! <laughs> With that accent, it's so awesome. Well, again, this is a trailer, so the Hulk does look CGI so much. He doesn't look anything like a real thing running. Even the manner of, of which he is running, it looks so fake. It's unbelievable, but again, he's going to totally look better in the movie, so j just scratch that. I'm just saying for, for the sake of saying it because this is a trailer and I'm, you know, judging by the trailer. But other than that, of course, this is going to look like 10 times better when you see the actual movie. <laughs> okay, and that's it, guys. Uh, this was an awesome awesome trailer just so awesome it's unbelievable they they managed to bring everything super cool and things that we always wanted to see and things that we always wanted to see but we didn't know that we wanted to see them so now they just do that and just showing us uh, all of that so i'm so happy with this i just can't wait to see like a full trailer even though this is like full trailer just a bit brief but it has so much in it that i'm feeling like i've watched three minutes trailer so guys this was awesome let me know what you think and what you thought in the comments down below i have to film more videos and, and by the way guys uh, my t-chip store is now made pro so to speak so i have to move everything from my regular t-chip store to my pro store and i'm going to change the links when when that happens it's going to have more function you're going to be able to see the same design to more products so uh, and maybe the shipping is going to be even cheaper so that's going to be so awesome i have to go and work on all of that a lot of workout inspired uh, inspirational designs and other things so thank you guys and as always i also take requests of whatever you want so that is guys thank you very much for watching until next time with gadget reviews and judging by the trailer